Hey guys, what's up? My name is Brandon. Welcome back to the Pokemon Soul Silver Hard Nuzlocke. This is episode 10, if I'm not mistaken. And if you guys remember, in the last episode, we actually fought off against Jasmine and got our sixth gym badge. Wow, six gym badges already? My god. Okay, this is going by really fast right now, and I don't know what we're going to do. Anyways, we're going to be moving on to the Lake of Rage this episode, and um, possibly take on the gym leader. Um, yeah. In fact, that's exactly what we're going to do. We're going to do all of what I just said, and uh, like despite all the time that we have, um, we're going to do it all. So Route 43... One, we can get a new encounter. Two, we got a ton of battles. We got a ton of battles. We got a ton of battles. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Alright. Let's get these guys out of my way. Let's get you out of my way. Okay, so you're done. <laughs> Quilava. Even though you're cool, Quilava, you're still gone. <laughs> okay. Alright, Spiro. Oh, dog, I'm banded. God damn it. Okay. Okay, wing attack you, and you're gone. Losing ends in front at all, you know, right? Okay. Let's go, Thickums. Let's get our... Never mind. <laughs> I, was, I was gonna say, let's go get our first encounter, and it wasn't even, um... An actual, like, Pokemon. It's just a trainer here. Picnic or Tiffany. I'm so I played too much. Oh my god. Let's not... Um, god damn it. Alright, let's see what our encounter is going to be. Um, even though, let's just battle you first. You have two po- You also have a Cacnea. Why do you both have Cacnea? And another thing is that the, the, the shiny Gyarados is going to be randomized. So it's going to be a random shiny. Which I'm absolutely looking forward to. Okay. Anyways, let's see what our first encounter is going to be. Come on, really? It's taking this long to get a freaking random encounter? Okay, finally, okay. Survey says... <sighs> I don't know how I feel about this. I genuinely do not know what to feel, like, how to feel about this. I don't know. I genuinely have no idea. <laughs> I mean, we gotta catch, we gotta catch it anyways, because, like, for dupes, and I bet you there's gonna be an even better better Pokemon in here. Let's see. What's the next thing? What's the next one gonna be? It's gonna be... Okay, you know what? Now that I think about it, that kind of made me feel a tiny bit better about getting the Pidgey. That kind of made me feel a tiny bit better about getting the Pidgey. I'm not gonna lie. Because Kecleon, not that great of a Pokemon. Just has a really weird gimmick to it. Color change, mix it. I don't feel better anymore. Why? Just why? <laughs> you had to give me a Pidgey! <sighs> I'm depressed, man. I'm freaking depressed. You have a freaking Magmortar! Bro, I don't know. I don't know how to feel. I genuinely don't know how to feel. Also, I feel like my camera has been off like an angle. I swear to God. Hold up. Let me see this. Oh God. Okay. Let me put it like this way. Oh, that's better. It looks a tiny bit better, at least. To you, it might not look any different, like at all, but. It looks a tiny bit different to me. Oh my goodness. We got freaking you. We got a Pidgey as an encounter. And there were Yuxi in the freaking grass. 
swear to god if i see if i see another freaking legendary pokemon pop up i'm literally about to crack my controller crack my controller break my controller okay that's not much better but I'll... <laughs> okay okay what else oh it, hey i want to see i want to see what it would have been i want to see what it would have been Okay, you know what? Alright, never mind. Never mind about that, then. It was, it was like dupes in Bad Encounter, anyways. Okay. Come on. Come on, my guy. Um, Fake out, really? You know what? Let's cut you, then. <laughs> Aerodactyl? Whoa, okay, you suddenly went up to level 30. How did you outspeed me? I mean, I know you're an Aerodactyl, but you're 20 levels below me. Now I'm also gonna try, also gonna take that off, but I'm gonna turn this on. Okay, not gonna lie, this doesn't feel any different whatsoever. Okay. Okay, what's here? Lake of Rage? Oh, whoa. Whoa. Alright then. Yo, we can get a Lake of Rage encounter here. I've never explored this part of the Lake of Rage before, unless I have and I completely forgot. We got a Nest Ball too. Nice. Yo. Let's see what it's gonna be. Survey says... A lombre? Hmm. Yo, do you have like swift swim? It'd be nice if you did. Alright. Dude, just come on. Thank you. Um uh. Oh Paba. I don't know why that name went in my head, but Opeba sounds nice. Yo, I don't know why, but I feel like the fact that I make up, like, names is, like, really weird, but really cool at the same time. More on the weird side, though. Because, like, n I, I give, I get, make up names for them, like, Ceruse for Garchomp, and people will most likely have no freaking idea where it even comes from. And just now for Opeba for the freaking Lombre, no one's gonna know where that is where that is even from. And frankly, if it did exist somewhere else other than me, I don't know where it is. Okay, I'm pretty sure there's a oh my god. What else is there in, in beside Lombre? Just Lombre? Is there really just Lombre? Is there really? My guy. Can we not my guy? Oh my god, this is a dead end. Oh my god, kill me. <sighs> I know it's raining. What's even here? Oh my god, this is also a dead end. Oh boy. There's a Pikachu in here. Oh my god. What's this item? A Katam 35 Solar Beam. Isn't that usually like flamethrower? I got no idea. I think I think TM 35 is usually like a flamethrower. Now that I think about it, it actually does make a little bit more sense. Also, my god. Don't you give me hidden power. Okay, so TM10 is Psybe. <laughs> and you know what this means? Everyone can learn it. Oh my freaking god. Can we just fly back, please? 
Let me fly. Yes. Oh my god. Thank you, Crobat. You're a freaking savior. You know that? Alright. Let's do this. Let's see what that red Gyarados is gonna be, my guy. Survey says... Oh, really? It moved out the way. What the heck was that? <laughs> this is like our third like thing like oh my god it's another Aeron oh my freaking god man bro yo not gonna lie though shiny Aeron is sick did you really Okay. Let me calm down first. Let me calm down first. Let me calm down first. Why did you use roar on me? Oh my freaking god, are you kidding me? Oh my god, I'm, I'm so not only not only can we get like a decent encounter here <laughs> This thing this shiny Pokemon used roar Fan freaking tastic and it would be my luck that that's the first move that he clicks in freaking insane! All right, that red Gyarados wasn't acting right. As I feared, somebody must have forced it to evolve. Oh, I'm sure. Oh my God, Aeron's a fully evolved Pokemon. What? Okay. All right. I'm done. I'm done. I can't do this. I can't do this. I cannot do this anymore, my guy. Did you come here because of the wild tales? You're Brandon. I'm Lance, a trainer like you. I heard some rumblings, so I came to investigate. I saw the way you battled earlier, Brandon. I can tell that you're a trainer with considerable skill. If you don't mind, could you help me investigate? Sure. Excellent. It seems that the Lake of Rage's Magikarp are being forced to evolve. A mysterious radio broadcast coming from Mahogany is probably the cause. And that suspicious souvenir shop. I'll be waiting for you on Mahogany. I'm so mad. I'm so mad. I'm so mad. I'm so mad. And by the way, that could have been the one time that that was actually a good nature Aeron. I don't know what you want from me. Whoa. Dragonite. Hyper Beam. Okay then. What took you so long? Just as I thought, that strange radio signal is coming from here. Come over here. Out of the way. The stairs are right here. We should split up to check this place. I'll go first. Uh, that guy's dragon type Pokemon are tough. Oh lordy. You found the secret stairway. How did you do that? I thought it was well camouflaged. All right, this cool place. That's cool. Hey, intruder alert. All right, let's just speed this up just because I don't want to waste time. Rattata, really? Sucker punch. Why does this actually seem like a party that you would have? A Burmy, uh-huh. Okay. Krogunk. And finally, you have a Togepi. Alright. That's kind of disappointing. Oh, 
Hold on, let me see this. It's a Persian statue. Its eyes are glowing red. I feel that somebody may be watching. I like I like the detail that they even put on that as well. The eyes of the Persian statue are no longer glowing. All right. All right, let's keep going. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. Going, going, my guy. All right. Scorpy dog, I have extra sensor. Eat this. Hijioto? Die. Goldine? Die. All right. Anyways, yo, we grinded all the way up just for like this going here. Heal powder. Alright. It's a Persian statue. Its eyes are glowing blue. You don't feel anyone watching you. Nice. You found a pearl. Yay! I found a pearl. Okay. A heal ball. Isn't this usually like a rare candy or something? I have no idea. Also, let's strip one of these so we can get a Pokemon. What the... Whoa. Whoa, whoa, hold up. I can't do anything. My game's frozen. <laughs> My game's frozen. Oh god. I might have to reload. Oh my, okay. Uh, you know what? I don't even, I don't know. I don't know what to say. We're gonna have to soft reset. Okay, for whatever reason, the game crashed there. So, yeah. I don't want to really go through all that again. Not gonna lie. So here, I'll actually shut off the the thing going here. All right, what would have been our first encounter here? Still the Kecleon, all right. All right, yeah, 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 we, we were talking about this. Are we able to skip all of you? Please tell me we can't. There's Dusclops here? Okay. There's the Uxie. Yeah, 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 we get it. Okay. I want to actually try and catch this thing, though. Please? Can we actually try and catch you? I want to see your sparkles. Yeah, that's cool. Why does Roar work the way that it does right now? Come on, stay in the ball, damn it. Oh, my God. He used Iron Defense this turn. Oh my god. Dude, I've caught freaking Moltres and Regirocks easier than this. He's gonna he's gonna kill himself. He has Rockhead. Oh my god. Bro. It doesn't matter. It genuinely does not matter. Oh my god. So we, we lost it both times. Wild. Actually wild. Genuinely wild. I don't know. Oh, frick. Wrong building. Yeah, I love how we have a freaking mammal swine, my guy. Okay, let's just skip through this. Skip through it. Get over here. Okay, let's save. 
save here. Come on, I've been through this already. Come on. Just let me go. 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 Come on. Come on. Keep this going. Keep this going. Keep this. Keep this. Keep this going. Okay. Really? Come on. All right. Come on, let's trip that secret switch. That quote-unquote secret switch. Why did it start lagging so badly all of a sudden? I don't even want... Well, you know what? Let's, let's go ahead. Da -da. Scorpy. All right. Die. Die. Okay. Yo, Ice Fang, though it's not super effective, I'm banded, my guy. I am banded, my guy. I love it. 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 I got a heal powder, like before. Oh, Mammoth Swine's glaring at the Persian. It's not even there. Oh god. Cried out? Nandato? Looking around restlessly for something. Dude, he's not ha he's not happy. My guy is not happy. Heal ball. Wait, it seems to be having a what? Glaring at your foe. I never really paid much attention to like all the Pokemon following you. It's really, it's a really cool feature though. He let out a roar, okay. Alright, let me save my game here. Because we tried to get an encounter here before and apparently it crashed our game. Like, just trying to get that crashed our game. Awkwardly, though. So let's see what it's gonna be. Yep. Happened again. Okay, this one's actually stable. It's a ferret. Um... Okay. Um. Let's name you. Nani? 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 Okay, alright, let's keep going. Let's keep going in here. Are you alright? Your Pokemon are hurt and tired. Let me give them. Here, give them some of my medicine. Oh, thanks for healing. Oh. Okay. Um, let's give uh, KFC some uh, screen time. We haven't seen KFC like at all today. I'm pretty sure at least. I'm actually recording this right after the last one. So. Oh, okay. Follow me. This is, this is not doubles. This is not doubles. Force palm, get out. Get out of here. All right. Door won't open? Well, duh, it has to have a password that only Team Rocket knows. Hmm. Hypno? Oh, really? How, okay. What? I lost? Yeah, you did. Oh. 
Oh. In order to unlock the door to the radio transmitter, you need the voice of a certain person. The name of the person is Petrell, the Team Rocket executive. I have found out he is hiding in their leader's office. Unfortunately, though, that room is also protected with a password. Okay. Luckily, I know the people who I just need to talk to. This person... Skitty. Get out. <laughs> Get out of here. Corsola. Get out of here. Slowpoke tail. And this guy. He goes like, Hayak, hayak, hayak. Alright. Interesting. Charmeleon. Hi, Charmeleon. Cha. Radicate tail. Why radicate tail? You got a full restore, my guy? A toxic orb. Uh, be useful on a freaking Flareon, you know? With guts, mind you. Flare Blitz! That's a good TM. That's a good TM. Who can learn it? Oh my god. Our, my grass and poison types can learn it. Oh my god. That's stupid but wild. Alright. Interesting. Alright. Okay. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Let's get Helix out. Mmm. Bro, it's so dark outside. My god. Surf you. Get out. Cheruby. Oh, you're so adorable. Look at him. You're about to die. Oh, you are dead. Never mind. Okay, headbutt. Die. Die. Oh, graphical errors. Yeah, that's fun. Ice beam. We just had that. We just had it too. We recently did have it. And everyone can learn it. Oh my god. Yo, KFC? KFC with freaking. It's Rash too, so. This is gonna do a lot of damage. Let's do it. Let's get rid of Bulk Up. This is gonna be a mixed attacker now. Of course we can get, go always go back and get ice beam from really from like goldenrod too so yeah let's keep just keep going with these <laughs> okay hold up i don't think we battle him here <laughs> so you were messing with them again <laughs> you must really like team rocket so much tell me who is the guy in the cave who used dragon type pokemon my pokemon were no match at all i don't care that i lost i can beat him by getting stronger pokemon it's what he said that bothers me he told me to stop eating the booty he told me that i don't love and trust my pokemon enough i'm furious that i lost to a bleeding heart like him <laughs> i don't have the time for the likes of you you just push me out of the way god damn it Okay, then. Alright. A choice scarf! Oh my god! Bro! Bro! That's amazing! Okay. Let's enter them to passwords, my guy. It's the boy. Except not really the boy. Well, I want to do Giovanni's voice anyways. <laughs> You are Brandon. Me. You don't know who I am. It is me, Giovanni. The majestic Giovanni himself. That's not what he would say. <laughs> huh? I don't sound anything like Giovanni? I don't even look like Giovanni? How come? I've worked so hard to mimic him. I am a Team Rocket executive. You must be trying to sneak into the radio transmitter room. Well, that's not going to happen. The room is protected with a special password. The password is Hail Giovanni. Surprised to hear it from me? Knowing the password won't help you though. The door won't open unless I say the password. 
It only reacts to my voice. Yo, not gonna lie, Petrella is freaking ugly. My god. Not gonna lie, he's freaking ugly. Alright. Oh god, okay. How come you ate that up so well? Excuse me. Ha, okay. Bayleaf, get out. Get out of here. Okay. I'm just gonna keep going. Oh, really? You a scrub? Hail Giovanni. You may be able to... I have no idea what I could do. Okay. First of all, let me heal that. Second... I think it's the heal powder that does that. It's very bitter, though. Oh, you know what I should have done? I should have talked to uh, my Amistar while it was sleeping. Password is how your body. Oh, God. Glaring at your foe. Oh, Jesus. Calm yourself. Come on, let's keep going. Hail Giovanni. Oh, snap, a damp rock. Nice, I didn't even bother to look there. Thank God, it, and thank God Murkrow got me that way. Oh, snap. A password is Hail Giovanni. Murkrow screamed the password, mimicking the voice of Petrel. The voice recognition the recognition system unlocked the door. Thanks, Murkrow. Hold it right there. We can't let a brat like you do as you please forever. It'll hurt Team Rocket's pride over and over again, making it lessen, you see. So it's time to finish you. However strong you may be, if the two of us fight at the same time, you'll have no chance of winning. Don't you agree? Sorry, baby. Now get ready to be thrashed. I have no idea. Hold it. A two-on-one battle? That is so unfair. Typical of Team Rocket to be so sneaky. Allow me to be j to join the battle. Oh yeah, a double battle, right? What? Yeah, an accomplice? Where's your sense of dignity? As interim boss in place of Giovanni, I'll show you how wrong it is to meddle with Team Rocket. Oh snap, it's time. It's time, Ariana. You have a Pidgeot? Holy balls, you have a Garchomp! Oh my god! Bro, Garchomp, Garchomp better Freaking destroy these guys. I swear to God. His dig. Oh my God. Why does Lance have a freaking guard shop? Why does he have a guard shop? That's so crazy. Oh my gosh. I'm going to click Earthquake because why not? So that's going to hurt you a tiny. That does nothing. Oh my God. Why do you have a... This, this is still going to drive me insane. Never is that going to... <laughs> oh my god. That's genuinely crazy. Okay, so that's done. Uh, air Slash, no thanks. Oh no, oh no, 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 no. Oh, this is a problem. This be a problem. Okay, you know what? Let's do this. Oh! Oh, actually... Yo, Garchomp. Shoutouts to you, my guy. But that's fine. The broadcast experiment was a total success. It doesn't matter what happens to this hideout now. We have much bigger plans. You'll come to appreciate Team Rocket's true power soon enough. Enjoy yourself while you can. <laughs> okay then. Sorry, Brandon. I saw how well you were doing. So I just hung back. Now all there is left to do is to turn off that odd radio signal. Okay, I think we're gonna be able to catch three Pokemon. Three static Pokemon. It's this machine that's causing all the problems. I don't see a switch on it. We have no choice. 
you have to make all the electrode faint. That should stop this machine from transmitting that strange signal. It's no fault of the electrode, so it makes me feel sad. Let's split up the job. Okay, let's do this. First encounter is... <laughs> you know what? No, first of all, was not. Second encounter is going to be a... Cedra? That's species, because we already have uh, a Kingdra. Bro, what's, what is life? What is life? We're getting all dupes Pokemon. We got all dupes Pokemon. Why? We got all dupes Pokemon. Okay. Alright. That odd signal has finally stopped. The lake should be back to normal. You're the best. Let me thank you on behalf of all the Pokemon. Oh yes, you should take this. I found it here, but I don't have any need for it. It's... Um, Whirlpool, right? Yep. Brandon, the journey to becoming the Pokemon champion is long and difficult. Knowing that, but you keep going. I see. No, you're right. If you were to give up that easily, you would never dream chase that dream in the first place. I look forward to seeing you again. Yo, Lance is a badass. Not gonna lie. Lance is a fucking badass. <laughs> uh... Oh my gosh. Alright, now we can challenge the gym, and let me tell you, I'm still really freaking terrified. Because gyms in this game are freaking difficult. Maybe it might just be because of the uh, level spikes, but good god! Alright, let's lead with Thickums. Let's get that going. Okay. Let's get you out. Motham. Hey, shout outs to A Drive. Shout outs to A Drive. Camouflage. I thought my game froze again. I'm just like, no, I don't have to I don't want to play this game. <laughs> I don't want to do that anymore. Oh my gosh. Let me save my uh, state as well. So Okay, alright. So let's do that. Paton. Um, it's got... Oh, hello. You have Ice Shard? Bro, I want Ice Shard. You have a... Wow. You actually... By the way, you actually have Ice types. Wild. Do you know how serious we are? Serious, serious enough to die? I think I did that wrong. Yeah, whoops. Oh, yep, I definitely did that wrong. Okay. Are you shivering? Are you scared to fight me? No. You have a Dratini. That's nice. Die. Yeah. Steelix. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, then. Bye, Steelix. Turtwig. Turtwig. Bro, that was wild. You're so scary. You're so strong, it's scary. Ambipom. Hi, Ambipom. How you doing? Oh, nasty plot. <laughs> okay. Interesting. <laughs> Them graphical errors are fun, aren't they? And a price is secret. Love disc. Hi there. Pedal dance. You die. Frostlass. Oh. Okay. Oh, Ice Shard. Oh, that was a crit. Okay. Wait, that was a crit and it did that much. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. Snover. Now I'm going to switch out to KFC. You better not miss this uh, Blaze Kick though. Okay, good. I'm so happy you have Ice Beam. It's basically like a better hidden power ice. Hmm.
Uh, let's heal up. Because I'm genuinely terrified. Hold up, what am I doing? Do I hate ice puzzles? Oh my god, okay. Yo, I genuinely hate ice puzzles. I'm not gonna lie, they're the worst. Bro, what the? Let's do this again. That's not it, is it? Yep. Okay. Hold up. One second. One second. Oh, wait. Ball sacks. Hmm. How do... Okay. Okay. Hold up. Wait. Up. Nope. Oh, um, yeah, I don't know how, how, how people usually do that. Do you really push it together? Oh, wait, I think I, I think I know what it is. I think I know what it is. CFDB right there. Yeah, there we go. Right, let's do this. Pokemon have many experiences in their lives, just like we do. I, too, have seen and suffered much in my life. Since I am your elder, let me show you what I mean. I have been training Pokemon since before you were born. I do not lose easily. I am Price, the Winter Trainer, and I shall demonstrate my power. Oh god. Oh, did I take off the... this thing here? No, he didn't. Okay. So you're level 45. Okay, not bad. Not, not a bad start. Although that's still kind of terrifying. Oh god. Okay, alright, rough skin. I don't really care. Charmeleon. Okay, let's send in Helix. Level 51. So we're on par. He's got flamethrower. But why is it why is it actually coming out of his mouth? I need to know. And is that really your your ace? If it is, I'm very disappointed. Scyther. Okay. Alright. Alright. Yep. I'm disappointed. I'm disappointed. What's going on? You have Night Slash? Dog. That That's pathetic. That was pathetic. I'm sorry. Seems my luck has run out. Alright. That was kind of a lackluster battle. Not gonna lie. Isn't that hail? TM07. TM07 is. Aura Sphere? Whoa. Okay. Alright. Cool. Alright. Um, I think I'm gonna wrap up this episode because. Yeah. A lot of stuff went down in this. Uh, we took on the Red Gyarados, which happened to be an Aeron that roared both times. Uh, we took on Team Rocket and Price, which was actually disappointing. Brandon, how are things going? I called because something weird is happening with a radio broadcast. They were talking about Team Rocket. Do you know anything about it? Maybe Team Rocket has returned. No, that just can't be true. Sorry to bug you. Take care. Yeah, I'm gonna wrap up this episode right here, right now, because I got to go. So, I'm gonna put down my controller and heal. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed today's episode and you wanna share your support, hit the like button down below for me, give me a thumbs up, and I'll really care. But if you do, subscribe, because it really helps on my channel. I'm gonna get the heck out of here. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace!